All right, here's a quick video on how to mod Shellshock after the 1.1 update. The first thing you want to do is go to the description, make sure that you've got the latest version of UABE. Some of you might already have it from before, but I've found that the earlier versions don't work. So make sure you've got that. Then go to the other link in the description where you find all the assets you can download the full folder individual folders or you can go into the folders and just download one file just make sure if you're downloading one or two files from a folder that you remember where they're coming from it will help you in the long run drag this into your into the whichever folder you want i'm going to edit it in photo peer this is a free program you can get image adjustments you can do whatever you want with it i'm just uh, doing it for whatever change all the colors this will do file export as png use whatever program that you want there put that in there i'm going to delete this one you can keep it if you want to but that was the original this is the modded version get rid of the the one now in uabe I'm going to open the asset file that the image was in. We're going to look for, uh, what was it called? C bumper. Put a star at the end so it checks everything. And oh, it didn't find it nice. So we're going to copy this just put it in here yeah. that's found it go to plugins edit load then we want to come to this folder copy this address use this open okay file apply and save all it's going to ask you it's going to save it into a just okay that just save it you don't have to put it somewhere special anymore go to shellshock live now you should have one that says modded mod it should say mod at the end keep the original Okay, make sure UAB E is closed because you've already got that open. Keep the original, just put original orange at the end, whatever. Take the mod off the end. Now, when you load up the game. No, it's the purple color that you had before very straightforward pretty much as it was before if you've got images that you've used before some of them might have changed the names or changed the sizes so just check that but you can still add them as you did before i've just made it easier by uh giving you the files so you don't need to do that as always, if you need any help, check out the Discord, reach out to me there. Find me at Twitch. Uh, yeah, and I'll always, always help you out.
have fun.